Brett Okamoto alongside UFC middleweight Paulo Costa, who takes on Luke Rockhold at UFC 278. And I saw you in the lobby a little earlier. I said you were skinny. You said, I'm lean. You're, you're lean for this camp. You do look a lot different, though. Do you feel different coming into this one? I feel better, yeah. But I, f I feel better than before. Uh, I think I got this pr my prime until here. Maybe I can, you know, make some progress on the next years. But until here, I'm 31. And... This is my, my prime time. Mm -hmm. what, why are you making it a point to tell people that? You said that on your Instagram as well. Why do you want people to know that this is your prime? Just because <laughs> it, it is, is a motivate to him, to, to everybody and put, a, put attention on that fight because it will be an amazing fight. Some, some people maybe can miss this, but I'm just alert everybody put their eyes on this fight because if you saw me fighting very explosive, very aggressive fighter, I will be on better, on better version mm -hmm. next Saturday. Don't pay attention. I, I put a lot of work on this mm -hmm. for bring the best for the people. What was different about the work you put in? Because as, as you've said and, and as we've all noticed, you look different. What was different about the work this time? I had no injuries now. Nothing since the, the, the fight um, last year. Uh, the most recent fight, I had no injury, so just everything going very well, very smooth, no problem, no issues, mm -hmm. you know. I'm al almost on the way right now. I could make a way tonight, tomorrow, and it's uh, Wednesday yet. Mm -hmm. So, and I found some good people. <laughs> I found some very good people. I deserve a lot credit to Kelson Pinto. This, th that guy is amazing. <laughs> I even get emotional when I talk about him. <laughs> <laughs> who, who is this? Kelson Pinto. He, he makes a lot of difference in my, in my life. What can you tell us about him? Huh? What can you tell us about him? He's a, a former boxer. He fought uh, Cotto twice, Miguel Cotto. Mm -hmm. he, he, he won one and was the, the last. <laughs> he makes a lot of difference in my life. I, I mean, it's obviously you're emotional about it, but I want to ask why. What, what has he done for you, Paulo? Sorry. No, it's okay. <sighs> He's very special, man. He's um, a true guy, you know, not fake. <laughs> oh my god yeah well I, mean, I, I i was not prepared for that <laughs> yeah yeah well you know maybe maybe we'll give you some time and i can ask yeah, you about it yeah, again after yeah. the fight because it sounds like you got a lot to, to say about the guy um what can you tell me about where you're at in your your career paulo yeah. where are you at in your career i know that you 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 yeah. recently tamar tamar is here he's kind of, he's helping me a lot yeah um sorry guys um yeah you're okay yeah well, yeah, I know that you, you parted ways with Waleed, your manager, right? And you said um, that it's because you guys had different thoughts on how your career, where your career was going. Where do you think your career is going? Where do you want to I, see your I, career I think, go? I think this, this change on, on, my, on my management was necessary because I had a different way, a different model, uh, um, a different way to of think about my career, and I think... We got, uh, I cannot talk about <laughs> because I got emotional yeah. again, but I, I'm emotional on on happy way, mm -hmm. not a bad way, you know? Yeah. I'm so happy, so happy to be here. And uh, I feel great as I think I never felt. Yeah. Have you been unhappy going into some, some yes. of your fights recently? Yes, Why? yes, yes. Why? Because... After the fight against Adesanya, that I, I really believe I would not fight that day, it was a horrible night to me. It's like a, a mancha, como fala isso? A, 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 a stain. Like a bad stain on career, you know? Mm -hmm. But, man, I, I think I, I, I read this on the past, and these are just a new time to do new things. Mm -hmm. Are you still on the last fight of your UFC contract? I, I don't know. I need to check. 
Okay, but <laughs> I you, don't know. you feel like 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 this is your home. Like like you have the, your big plans. They all they're all here in the UFC. Oh, I don't know. You know, I I really don't know. This is a great company. I'm glad for everything, but I'm not happy. Everybody knows with my contract. Mm -hmm. Does, I'm happy to be here to do what I want to do, uh, what I love to do. But mm -hmm. I think the the contract is very uh, ultrapassado. Uh, how do you say ultrapassado? Old ancient. Yeah, outdated. Updated. Mm -hmm. You need to update that quickly. Uh, maybe uh, this uh, was necessary a couple of fights ago. Yeah. Do you feel like this is the fight where so, you... Sorry, just, just to clarify. So I don't know my future. I, I need to to talk, mm -hmm. you know. You know, I have a lot of good opportunities out, out, outside as well. Um, I love boxing. Mm -hmm. I Everybody knows that. Mm -hmm. So let's see. But it's a very good company. Yeah. Do you feel like because, because of sort of the uncertainty about your future, it makes this fight more important? How important is it to make sure that you get a win in this fight? That will, you know, how important is this fight? Project you forward, yes. Oh man, it's so very important, so very important. That's why I put my life, my whole life, for long six months straight. I have been uh, just looking for this fight. Uh, you know, uh, not not against Hakuhod because I knew him two months ago, but I know I I need to put my high, high, high best performance mm -hmm. on the next one, and this will be on Saturday. Mm -hmm. Now I can talk about Kels if you want. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, if you want to, yes. Why has he meant yeah, so much he's amazing. You? He's so amazing. <laughs> he's uh, he, uh, um, he's a, a true guy. I don't know how to say this, but, you know, uh, I, 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 feel, I feel everything coming here, can, uh, what, what comes from him is, is truly, you know, and he cares a lot about He's amazing, and he gave me a lot of skills, a different skills, a very good skills that I, I had not. You understand? Yeah, like what? What is the biggest, what Football, is the greatest thing? that Go in, yeah. go, go out, you know? And in the way of he, make my, he made my train camp, had uh, given me healthy mm -hmm. to know, had injury now, mm -hmm. and to and help my, way, uh, my weight going out uh, low very quickly as well so he changed my life yeah yeah it sounds like it's not you're happy you're on weight you're healthy um you got a lot to fight for what are you going to do to luke rockhold on saturday i have to just imagine that all of those things together is going to turn into a great performance what do you think this performance is going to look like i think it will look like a master class okay Master class. Well, we'll look forward to it against Luke Rockhold on Saturday, UFC 278. Nice to see you back here. And Thank you, back man. Back here again, man. Sorry, guys, for the emotional part. <laughs> yeah, it's all good. It's very real. We appreciate it. Yeah. Thanks, bud. Good Thank luck. Thank you. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.